The Grand Nance residence is home to more than 250 Concordia University residents on the Sir George Williams campus of Concordia University. Do you want to know the history of the Grand Nance residence? Well, I'll tell ya. Back in 1864, and probably actually even more, the Catholic Church started a chore, test they'd done so right before. Now I'll tell you what they did way back when Grandma was a kid. With all the fun stuff they forbid, they found a spot of other grid. It was a green and luscious place, a perfect place to say a grace. Beside the mountain at the base, construction started quite a pace. They had a river, well, a stream, so perfect for the godly theme. They drew their plans to start the scheme, building up their next regime. And we don't know what they're gonna do with this. But we know that student housing isn't permanent Fine Arts is taking over Grey Nuns residence First time Fine Arts has ever taken precedence Oh and while this building's really old, we're thankful that the nuns had sold. It cost us a ton of gold, but it's a place out of the cold. Before they moved, and I'm not joking, you could even spot them smoking on their balconies and cloaking. It's by now they all are croaking. They found this spot in Montreal, and with the second Pope John Paul, their numbers really start to fall. So back to France, the nuns recall, lacking some euphoria, a final song of Gloria. They sold it to Concordia, along with all the Floria. The only way to get in is with your key. The building century is old, yet we use RFID. We're soon to say goodbye if the school gets its way. And I've never understood how these nuns are gray. It's downtown, gray nuns is in a perfect position. This server room's the only room that's air conditioned. With a metal gate, green space, and flowers in the garden Staying here will cost more than a Catholic pardon And we don't know what they're gonna do with it But we know that student housing isn't permanent Fine arts is taking over Grey Nun's residence First time fine arts has ever taken precedence and that's the story of the Grey Nun's Mother House.